hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in this tutorial you will learn how to model and design and analyze a basic concrete slab using film design software i hope you are following me step by step Let's start. First, I switch on my film design software and select the National Annex Norwegian. Step 1 Define the slab and slab properties. Step 2 define the linear pinnet and fixed support. Step 3 define the load cases and apply load cases on my surface of slab. Now it's the time to generate the load combination manually. The load combination will be done according to the Euro code. Please follow me.
I generate machine on my setup and change the size. Now I run analyze and check the result. First, I check the displacement. I add some value. I can change the maximum and minimum value. Let's so change my uh, to combination to surface surface visibility limited state, and you can see with color. I can check check my translation displacement. Now I check my reaction force, but ultimate limit state. Yes, I will add uh, some resultant result. I add some value. If you don't like to have, uh, have, have all of the result, you can switch off from here. Just I would like to see the vertical deficit. You can see it here. Next, I check the internal force. Start from MX moment. You can Increase the scale. I check the MY. I would like to check the shear force. And you can see the, if you like, you can see the all of the normal forces, shear force, torsion, MN, M2, principle moment. Self. Now I would like to run RC analyze. The first I should cal calculate. First I check my calculation. I have a thin dia bar. I add some uh, correct width, 0 0.4, 0 0.4. Now I check it. If you see the utilization is not okay. Just I want to run the auto analyze. Now everything is green. The light utilization is above 97, 90%. This is quite nice, and you can check the river layer.
you can see if you want uh, the amount of rebars of it, the color. If you see the color is described uh, in which place how many rebar we need. You can see it, we have 260 in yellow color, 263.6 in yellow color. And you can check in the top and you can check in the bottom and check it with the colors. I will add the local coordinate in my setup to understand the, the direction of setup. I run an animation. I refresh my design. Now everything is updated. I hide my color. And we have one option in film design. The correct, we have a note zero in the bottom, zero in the top. And we can run the correct section anal analyze. And load combination, just I select in the serviceability limit to the correct. Also re recalculate. After we apply the reinforcement, we run the crack analyze to check the exact amount of crack. As we show, still we don't have any crack in this lab. We check the displacement again. This is 0 0.9, 0 0.8, sorry. It's one millimeter decrease. We check the we have one option missing rebar if some place we need the uh, rebar we can check in the missing it's sure if the negative is negative if the value is negative it means we have a little bit more rebar if there is positive we should add a, add and we check the shear force we want 26 and we apply it 92 there is no need for uh, Shear rebar in this setup. Okay. Just again, we check the result. You will get the, all the result, the full information. You see the stress and strain diagram and minimum re reinforcement according to the Eurocode consider utilization here that's a very important diagram you can see the utilization the reinforcement you can see the shear force you can see the crack everything is showing here 
That was all. Thank you for watching. I hope see you in the next episode. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Bye.